Konnichiwa Mina-san, Animated Dreams here with another unboxing. Sorry about the abrupt opening to this video. I lost some footage while transferring files over. Anyway, this is Kana Hoshisato, a character from the late Matsu Tomohiro, author of Hatana Illusion. And I'll let my past self take it from here. There is an illustration from my all-time favorite illustrator, Yabuki Kentaro. Good. There's the next one. And here's the top. The top is pretty overlooked, but it does say the logo. Now it's time to unbox. Okay, there she is outside of the box and in the plastic. Looking nice. So the first thing we see in the box is her platform or base. And it looks like it's red, transparent. But her logo is on there for the series. And it's Kana. So there's a lot of plastic on here. Maybe I can take these all out as soon as I can. All right, that took way longer than I thought. Oh, okay, I'm gonna take off the plastic, but there she is. And she looks really colorful, and that's really nice. I think it's my first time actually owning a clone figure, so we'll see what she looks like in close-ups when I get there. For now, it looks pretty good. And let's get to those close-ups. Okay, so as far as this 1 in 7 scale figure goes by Plum, I think it's a pretty simple figure. Khan and this pose and expression show that she definitely loves what she does and that's striving to become a great, great magician. The colors are bright and bend pretty well together. I didn't see any hard blending into another or any poor paintwork. I love the attention to detail with the folds and wrinkles in her clothing. It really makes it look like everything is flowing in the wind, especially with her yellow magic scarf. Kana's face and expression are cute, but there was something off about the way some of the angles looked. Depending on where you look at her face, it can seem like it's pretty flat, and I felt like it was distracting from how attractive the figure was as a whole. Overall, this figure was pretty good and there were no major cons for Kana. I'm really looking forward to the anime adaption once it comes out. I feel that Hatana Illusion would have been a good series, and it's great news that an anime was decided. That's all for this unboxing and review of Kana. Tell me what you think of this figure in the comments, and if you want to see more, head on over to my channel and hit that subscribe button. This is Animated Dreams, and I will see you in the next one.